I'm gonna show you guys how to make a really yummy chocolate chip banana bread. Here we go. Um, so you're gonna first start with two cups of rolled oats. I'm using gluten-free ones just cause my husband. Um, so that's easy. So this will be a gluten-free recipe, um, but you can also use something else if you guys prefer. The cool thing about cooking is you can go to any dietary restrictions. Like people ask me all the time, I have this restriction, this restriction, what should I sub it for? You guys, Google, I promise is your best friend. It has substitutions for literally everything. Um, now we're adding three bananas. I usually use riper bananas than this, but since we just moved, I don't have, I usually keep them in the freezer as soon as they go really ripe. That's what I would use for banana bread, but this is what we're using today. So three um, ripe bananas, we're gonna use two eggs, full eggs. We're gonna use one eighth cup syrup, an eighth cup of syrup. You're gonna use one package of applesauce. This keeps it really moist, you guys. Definitely add this step. This is just sugar-free applesauce. Um, my son loves these, so we always have these on hand. They're really good in cakes, um, breads, any of this stuff. We're gonna add a dash of salt. We're gonna add a teaspoon of baking soda. And then we're gonna add 33 chocolate chips. Um, these are the Lily's chocolate chips. Use whatever you guys want. Um, and now you guys can mix this all you want. You guys can get a full arm workout in by mixing it. I'm not going to, I'm just gonna blend it up. Uh, and we're gonna, I'm gonna show you guys what to do next. Once this is nice and blended, we are going to put this in. So you have to make sure your loaf pan is sprayed with um, a nonstick spray. Make sure it is, or line it with parchment paper, um, or you're gonna be wrestling your bread out. We are going to put this in here. Mm, this is so freaking good, it smells delicious. And then we are gonna bake this on 350. And you guys wanna make sure it's fully cooked. You guys can put a toothpick in, but I'm gonna show you guys how this bad boy looks. Let's throw this in the oven. 